You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop. Excited to check out the Chocolate Edition Dominoes. It is the classic family board game with a delicious chocolate twist. Yes, you can eat the game pieces. Now, let's just see. There's a bunch on the back here. I will try to read some of this for you here. The good news is that the tray inside, they tell you here, you can reuse it and make your own chocolate dominoes with that. All the playing pieces are made from deliciously smooth milk chocolate. And by the way, this came from dear friends all the way from the UK. They went there on vacation, came back with this and said, here, you want to try it on video? And I said, for sure. Let's see, take all the trophy dominoes and put them to one side, keeping them safe for the winning player to claim at the end of the game. Place all the numbered chocolate dominoes face down on the playing board and mix them up so you don't know what numbers are on them. Each player then chooses seven dominoes each, leaving the remaining dominoes face down. This is called the boneyard and keeping their dominoes secret from the other players. Okay, and so on and so forth. Right now, I am not gonna play dominoes. I'm gonna eat dominoes. You'll need to keep your cool though, otherwise you might find your dominoes melting before you even play them. If you wish to play again, then you can simply melt your favorite chocolate, ensuring it is not too hot before it is poured into the mold. Tap it to remove any air bubbles. Adults should supervise children when making chocolate. Allow the chocolate to cool before use. Now isn't that cool? So you actually can remake your chocolate dominoes. I thought that was pretty neat. But we're here to kind of learn about the product. And I'm not going to actually play dominoes. I'm going to eat them, like I said. Here we go. 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 Now, I'm guessing, I'm just guessing that I have this the wrong way. Let's take a peek. I do. Okay. Ooh, look at that. It survived its plane flight. Okay, so this is like a domino game board. Look at that. Pretty cool. I have done a ton of chocolate games, so anytime one comes my way, I'm going to make a video of it. Let's just take a sneak peek at this side. There's the trophy. There's two trophies. And then all the other numbered dominoes. That one's blank one, blank two, blank three, blank four, blank five, blank six, one, 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 two, one, three. Going all the way to six, six. All right, here we go. Might as well take them all out, right? Okay. They do have a nice glassy sheen to them. Let me get them all turned over here. So I'm not really, I've never really played dominoes much. I know you're supposed to match numbers or something or other there and kind of build off of that. So that's probably why I'm not gonna necessarily play. Well, let's read it a little bit. Maybe I can learn something I've never played before. Okay, the aim of the game is to simply get rid of all your dominoes before everyone else without eating them. The player with the highest double goes first, place it on the board face up. The next player must then place a domino with a matching number next to the first one. You can only add a domino to the board if it has a number that matches a number. So like I did there, I did the two to two. Then someone's got to have a four to match the four, right? And then you could keep building. And let's see... Okay, number one, number on one, open on a domino board. If you do not have a matching domino in your selection, you must collect a domino at random from the boneyard until they have all been used up. Single matching dominoes must be placed end to end. Ah, single, ma okay. Double matching dominoes where the domino is the same number on both sides must be placed side on to the matching number. The winning players use all their dominoes first. Okay. Well, not much more I could do except eat. I'm going to eat. Let me break one of the trophy ones so you can kind of see. And then we'll give an idea on the taste. Nice creamy tasting chocolate. You probably can make these milk chocolate. I mean white chocolate too. Mmm, that is good. Now could I do this too if I wanted to? So if this was here, I can't necessarily put this here. I have to build on it. I guess I have to play dominoes more. All right, let me try one more here. And now I'm definitely going to keep this tray. So you would just make your own chocolate, 
They don't want it super hot because it's probably not necessarily completely made for piping hot chocolate. So you cool it down a little before you put it in there, like they said, and then tap the tray out. And then you can make your own little dominoes. Very cool. All right, there you go. Chocolate edition dominoes all the way from the UK. And thanks for watching. If you want to see other candy games and candy like this, look in that description. I'll have a playlist there. Or you can search Lucky Petty Shop. What am I going to do with all this chocolate now? I know exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to eat it. Later! If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. Please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up.